This is a video showing how to calculate the hydrogen ion concentration using a pH within SparkView. First, I'm going to create a new page with a table on it. I've clicked on the plus icon at the top of the page, and now I'm going to select the largest format table icon from the right hand side. I'm going to uh, select the table from here. On the top of the first column, I'm going to click on Select Measurement, and I'm going to select my pH and display that. Next, I'm going to click on the Select Measurement at the top of my second column. I'm now going to select on User Entered at the upper right hand side, and then go down to Create Edit Calculation. Once I've done that, that will bring up a calculator. Since I'm calculating my hydrogen concentration, I'm going to name my variable HConc. And then type in the equal sign from my keyboard. Since the pH is the negative log base 10 of the hydrogen ion concentration, we're going to instead use the base 10 by clicking on the 10 caret x and then creating an open parenthesis here. We're going to click on the negate sign down here and then we're going to select under measurements we're going to select our pH and close this value here. So that we have the units displayed properly we'll click on uh, properties here and next to units we'll click on the keyboard. Since we'll be displaying the concentration in molarity we will put a capital M there and click on OK. And I'll click on OK again and click on Done. And click on OK. We'll now click on Measurement. We'll go to User Entered and we'll select the Hydrogen Ion Concentration. And we'll click OK. To make this a little bit easier for manual uh, for manual data collection, I'll click on my sampling methods and click on manual and click OK. So now when I click on the play button, it will display not only the pH of the solution, but the concentration of the hydrogen or hydronium ions within that solution. 